Hey, Dean from Leisure Travel Vans, we're very excited. 2023 model year is here and we have the brand new Wonder FTB. If you're looking for a small motorhome, only 24 feet, nine inches long, under 10 feet exterior height, 711 wide, a motorhome that you can take big city RVing and out in the wilderness as we are right now in beautiful Eastern Manitoba in the Sandy Lands, this is the motorhome for you. Big exterior storage, can't wait to show you that and beautiful interior storage plus a brand new wood color on the Wonder Motorhomes. I am so excited about showing this motorhome. This is the perfect two-person motorhome and of course powered on the Ford Transit chassis. You're going to absolutely love that chassis. I can't wait to show you the interior so let's get started. Come on inside. Hey, welcome inside the 2023 Wonder FTB. We've some, made some great changes for 2023. We've extended the floor into the driver passenger area, so one flush floor all the way through. We've also added a beautiful brand new tile look linoleum floor. You're gonna get on your hands and knees. It feels like ceramic tile. It's actually linoleum, so easy to clean. We've added beautiful new LED lights throughout the entire motor room, so lots of beautiful lights inside of course we have our two big picture windows in the FTB which is fabulous for lots of natural light we've added three new wood colors three new leather colors and we have our two Corian countertops and of course our optional white upper cabinets and we're gonna get into all of this stuff right away but look how much room we have in this motorhome so two sofa areas right for comfort relaxation both of our chairs on the Ford Transit chassis turn and swivel. So if I have additional guests over, kick back and relax. I can sit back and watch TV. I can use these as an ottoman. How comfortable is that? And I love how this can actually become a chaise lounge. Look, I can move the cushions around, make this into a beautiful chaise lounge. Kick back, relax. I love this. This is so much room. This is a non-slide. So if you're looking for a non-slide motorhome, you're looking at a class B van. This is one size bigger. It's going to give you all of this room. It's going to give you a dry bathroom, tons of exterior storage and tons of interior storage, all at 24 feet, nine inches bumper to bumper. So lots of great space plus storage, even underneath our sofas we have storage look at this so we have outside storage and on both sides we have storage inside here and we have storage under this sofa as well look at this so lots of storage space unbelievable exterior storage interior storage and from a sofa area great for entertaining becomes two separate twin beds for sleeping this is absolutely fantastic. So this is a beautiful twin beds, separate beds, both sides as you can see. Or, are you ready for this? I can pull them together and make one queen bed. This is very cool. You can see how simple it does. Just pull them together, look at that. They lock in place. And look how simple that was. I now have a beautiful queen size bed. You can see it locks in place. I'm gonna sit right in the middle. Look. I can't move it apart. Nope, and I have a beautiful queen size bed. Absolutely perfect. Now this is versatility of a living room area. Plus, another great feature is I have my TV right there with my sound bar that has streaming Bluetooth, and it's a swivel TV so I can turn it on the side, and I mean, this is heaven. Okay, and then back into a living room area. Plus, I forgot to mention in the bed area, I have two USB charging ports, one on each side, and I've got inverted electrical plugs on both sides as well for a sleep acme machine. Also, another nice little feature, you can see how we cut into the cab area here, so I have easy access from the driver cab area into the motorhome. I'm not gonna trip now that I have a flush floor, and I'm not gonna bump my head, which is fabulous. Some storage areas up here, 
storage up on here. We also have lots of upper storage. And look at these two beautiful picture frame windows, awning style, which simply means that I can uh, open the windows, have them wide open here like this. It can be pouring rain outside and I have cross ventilation. We also have nighttime shades built right in and you can leave the windows open because we have shade holders built into all the windows so you can have your windows open at night and have some air coming in and no light at all. Up here, look at this, beautiful opening skylight. Look at that. Is that not beautiful? Lots of beautiful natural light, lots of ventilation, lots of air. And if it's kind of hot outside and you want to still have some air, bring this across, no sunlight. Happen to have a cloudy day like we have today, but there's a few bugs out. I can bring this across and have that open and now the bugs can't get into the motorhome. This is a brand new feature on all 2023 Leisure Travel Van motorhomes is a multiplexing system, the Firefly multiplexing system, which means that I can run the entire motorhome right off this main control panel. You're gonna see secondary control panels throughout the motorhome, but what this does, it allows me to run the entire motorhome. I can turn all the lights on, I can turn all the lights off, I can start up my generator, I can set my air conditioning, I can set the furnace, I can set the heat. Everything is controlled off the multiplexing system. And another great feature download the app and you can run it off your smartphone the entire motorhome as well so another great feature to have with a multiplexing system while wow, the interior of the ftb is absolutely breathtaking look how much room and space i have once again we're in a non-slide there's not a slide out nice and quiet going down the road panoramic view driving but look how much room we have plus we have three new wood colors this is the brand new mocha we have white oak and rift oak. So three different wood colors. We have three new leather colors, including sand, dove, and clay. The model that we're showing right now has dove leather. Once again, interior storage is so important, especially the smaller the motorhome, the less storage you have. You wanna make sure you have lots of interior and exterior storage. Look at these big, beautiful upper cabinets here. And once again, big, beautiful upper cabinets here, all done with uh, hidden hinges, European hidden hinges. We have soft close. Listen how beautiful that sounds as they lock in place. Also great option is the white uppers. These are the Fenix white uppers. And you're gonna absolutely love the brand new LED lights that we've put into the motorhome with this beautiful wood trim look. It provides diffused, even soft lighting throughout the entire motorhome. You're also gonna love this TV. We have it on a swivel. Look how it moves out. Once again, we talked about the sound bar. It's also got a streaming Bluetooth on it, so you can move the TV here. You actually can bring the TV all the way out and watch it while you're cooking. I actually love that, right? If you're doing a recipe off of YouTube or something, right? I can be doing the recipe while watching the TV. Absolutely smart. Bring it back over here. For watching TV in bed, I can watch it from this way. From the driver passenger seats, I can watch it from there, there. Absolutely fantastic. Locks back in place, which is very cool. And then up above here, we've got our standard smart Blu-ray player, which makes the TV smart for people that want to download uh, Netflix or they want to download YouTube channel, things like that, you can do that. We also have our TV booster here and our Wi-Fi booster. So up on the roof standard, we have the WineGuard Wi-Fi booster, which will pull a Wi-Fi signal in from the campground, or if you're at a McDonald's or a Starbucks that has free Wi-Fi, you can pull that into the motorhome. You can also buy the service from WineGuard, or you can get a secondary chip, and you can put it in that runs off of your smartphone provider. We've also got some uh, inverted plugs up here, and if you have a satellite dish, we have the optional WineGuard satellite dish. The satellite receiver goes in here and plugs right into here, and then you can have satellite TV as well. I mean, this is fun just to chill out and relax. It feels like I have so much space. I actually think I could sleep this way as well. But if I have to get some work done or it's time for dinner or I wanna play some cards, I need a table, correct? Correct. So let's show you how easy that is. So first, I do have to do some work when I'm on the road and look how easy the table is to bring out. Boom, look at this. There it is. Table, drink holders, and a workstation as well. So let's get this work done that I must get done first. Look at this, pull out the laptop. Now I've got a complete workstation, work area to work on. 
right? Dinner time, no problem. Want to play cards? Absolutely fantastic. Table turns and swivels. Place here for my drinks. I absolutely love it. So what a great work area, dinner area, playtime with cards, and look how simple it goes back into its holder. Boom, out of the way. Got a place here to put my laptop away, and we can kick back and enjoy our veen. Now that is a smart use of space. Okay, a couple cool things in the entrance door area. Obviously, we have our beautiful screen door. I like the supports that we have here. If you have pets, they're not gonna go through the screen door. Easy to open and close right here. Very nice. And look, a place for your shoes. They slide underneath the step well, so you're not gonna hurt yourself getting in and out of the motorhome. Okay, we got a 12 volt battery disconnect switch. So if you're going for a walk at night, turn off the battery disconnect switch, turns off all the lights inside the motorhome. Look at this, night lit handle for getting in and out of the motorhome. Fire extinguisher for protection. One of our secondary multiplexing panels right here. And this is how great it is. I can turn all the lights off. Look at this right there, boom. Turn them all back on, boom. Very nice. Up here, we've got a nice privacy nighttime shade at night, that little magnet here that locks it in place so you don't have any light going into the motorhome. And then up here, we've got our inside service center. So we have the multiplexing panel, controls most of the motorhome. Couple little things that we have here that you have to concern yourself with is number one, we have our optional solar panels. So 200 watt or 400 watt, that's a rigid panel up on the roof. And that this is our control panel for that. Over here, we have our 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter control panel. So for example, we're dry camping right now. So we have our inverter on, which takes our batteries, flips them over to 120 volt. That's how we're watching TV. And that's how we have all of our lights running and everything like that. So that controls it right there. And here's our Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater. So two important settings on here is Eco and Comfort Plus. If you leave it on Eco, it does not preheat the water. If you turn it to Comfort Plus, it preheats the water so you have instant hot water in your galley, in your bathroom, and in your shower. You also have a couple of other settings here for off. You have another one for clean. If you put it on clean, it's going to take about 45 minutes and 8 gallons of water. So the only time you want to clean it is when you actually want to clean it, which you should do maybe once or twice a year. And we also have a winterization mode here as well. This light here, see that light when it turns on? Okay, so we have the optional lithium batteries on this motorhome, so 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter, optional lithium batteries, 200 amp hours. If you turn this on, it will heat the batteries. There's heat pads on them, keeps them nice and warm. You only wanna do that in colder weather. Lithium batteries don't like to go below 34 degrees Fahrenheit. So if it gets cold like that, then you would turn that on and keep those lithiums warm and they will then charge and use a charge. Also, if you order the lithium batteries, we invert the microwave right here, which is very cool. So in the morning, you're in a campground, you can't turn on your generator, it's too early in the morning, you wanna have some coffee or you wanna warm something up in the microwave, you can simply do that by turning on the inverter. The lithium batteries are inverted to this and boom, you can use your microwave. So very simple right here, a few little things there. Interior storage, the most important thing in a small RV, and we have interior storage like you wouldn't believe on the FDB. Look at that beautiful hanging closet. Down below this beautiful hanging closet, more storage space, absolutely fantastic. Look at all that storage. A little earlier you may have seen this, we had our where our table comes out of right here. And then over here is where we have our converter box, fuse box, so if you ever have a, an electrical problem, check your fuses, check your breakers, but simple to do in a nice place. And look at this, storage, 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 storage. Plus, look at this, a pantry. Look at all that storage. Okay, we're in the galley area. Now look at the size of this galley area. This is huge. I love the countertop flush mounted as well. We have our beautiful stainless steel sink with a nice sink cover over top of that. Look at that beautiful view of the campground area on the patio side, awning style windows, nighttime shades as well, but lots of ventilation through the motorhome, but the picture window looks fantastic. Storage, look at this. 
beautiful storage. We talked a little earlier about our LED lights, but look, rope lighting in the cabinets. And one thing about storage, you wanna make sure the cabinets are deep. Look how deep these cabinets are. Hugely deep, right? Coming all the way up to my sleeve of my arm. You can see along my arm is, look, all the way deep. So deep cabinets are very important because you can have a cabinet, but if you can't put anything in it, it's not much of a cabinet. Once again, European hidden hinges. We have our optional white uppers. And look at this, soft close as well. Spark ignition stove, we talked about that a little earlier. You can see how easy it is to fire up. You can barely see that flame, but it's hot. So make sure that it's off. Leave that up, it's a splash guard, so you're not gonna splash all over the place. So it's gonna be easy to clean this beautiful galley area. And look at this beautiful accessory channel, spices, paper towel holder, inverted plug in the morning for coffee, right? Here's a great thing, right? Plug in your coffee maker here, right? Turn on your inverter and run your coffee maker without running the generator, very, very smart. But a beautiful solid Corian, two different colors. We have concrete and Antarctica white. So two different colors there. And look at this beautiful mocha cabinets, right? So three different wood colors. This is mocha. Look at that. Full drawer extension glides, soft close. Look how deep these cabinets are. Fantastic. Put a lot of stuff. Look at that pot and pan drawer. Perfect. And look at this over here built-in garbage can. So very easy to access your water pump and your Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater. Okay, this seriously blows me away. I have to get down on my hands and knees. I swear this is tile, but it's not. Is that beautiful? That is a good product, man. That looks great. And look way up here, fantastic fan. Look, all controlled by our multiplexing system. Press the button. Boom, it goes up, fan comes on. So if I'm cooking, I'm, all the fumes are gonna go out. And these fans can pull some serious air out of the motorhome. Once again, we wanna turn the fans off, press the button, fans off, close the lid, press the button, lid comes down. Very, very simple. Okay, let's have a look on the other side of the galley. We talked about our beautiful pantry. Look at that beautiful rope lighting. Once again, mocha wood color, looks fantastic. Convection microwave, like nice big convection mic, right? So this will be a normal microwave. You can also be a convection microwave as well for baking, which is really cool. And then our Dometic three-way fridge. So it runs on 120 volt, it runs on 12 volt and propane. And it opens this way, it opens this way. And if I needed to, and I'm in the bathroom, I needed to grab some water for brushing my teeth. Look at this, look how simple that is. I don't even have to leave the bathroom area. So dual fridge opens two doors both ways and it's a three-way fridge so it runs on propane it runs on electric and 12 volt so if you ever have an electrical problem let's say your batteries were dead and you had an electric fridge you no longer have a fridge this way you have three different sources of power to cool the fridge okay right up above here we've got our 15,000 btu air conditioner with a built-in heat pump so not only will it keep the motorhome cool if it was a cold morning and you're plugged in you could use the 120 volt system at your campground and it will heat the motorhome so that way you don't waste your propane okay one of the great features on the wonder ftb is a large and i mean large residential bathroom beautiful pocket door for privacy push it out of the way and come on in and look at the size of this shower. It's the largest shower on any Wonder motorhome. Okay, residential style bathroom, not a wet bath. You're not sitting on the toilet to shower. I have my own stand-up shower. That is absolutely fantastic. And I don't wanna make my Unity Murphy bed customers bad, but I think this is the biggest shower that we have beautiful skylight got a place here for your drip drying your clothes and your towels right there you can hang it in place very nice led light another little hanger here of course we have our shower head it's got a little resistance here so you can control the water right there turn it off and on built in place here for your shower soaps and your shampoos of course hot and cold runner we have the truma aquago comfort plus hot water heater so we have unlimited hot water when you're plugged into shore water i like this look at this beautiful shower door it's got a built-in squeegee so all the water flows back into the shower pan but look how much room we have. Like I'm not a small man. The Jenny Craig thing's not working. I'm over 6'1", maybe 6'2", but look, I can't even touch the top. 
on my tippy toes. But look, lots of room, fabulous bathroom. So this is called a dry bath. So we have a residential dry bath in the Wonder FTB. And then from your multiplex panel, you can turn on your 12 volt fantastic fan, bring all the uh, steam from the shower out into the environment. While I'm standing here in the shower, let's talk about this beautiful vanity, little stainless steel sink, solid Corian countertops, accessory channel, place there for your toothpaste, toothbrush, down below some storage area as well. Now that I'm sitting on the toilet side, you can see here we got some nice hanging hooks there for towels. We also have a 120 plug right here, and you can turn on your water pump here on my control panel. Once again, we showed the fantastic fan. I love the LED light here. Big mirror, and speaking of mirror, hey, make sure you check out our store for leisure travel vans and clothing www.leisurevans.com we have a beautiful store with coffee mugs and shirts and lots of great things you can accessorize yourself while you're driving your leisure travel van that's fantastic and of course we've got our beautiful china toilet right here up here look at this nice uh, medicine cabinet built right in there so lots of places to put all your medicines when you're out RV and of course locks in place nice and tight. I also like this feature on the toilet. We have a built-in bidet. <laughs> no, not quite unless you like cold water, but you use this to clean your toilet bowl, which is very, very nice. Okay, now that was a fun walkthrough of the brand new 2023 Wonder FTB. Three new wood colors, three new leather colors, two different Corian countertops, of course, the optional white upper cabinets, twin beds, pull into a king bed, big dry bathroom, big galley, tons of interior storage space, pull out TV, opening skylight. We also have multiplexing that you can run the motorhome off of your phone, off the app. I mean, it's basically got everything. Two sofa areas. I mean, it's fun, fun, fun. So now let's have a look at what powers this motorhome down the highway. Okay, as we come into the cab area, I mean, we have to have a look at this beautiful panoramic view. I mean, I think this is the big one. If you have a traditional Class C, you are stuck in a tunnel driving. Look at that 10-speed automatic transmission. It has a 3.5 V6 engine. It's the EcoBoost engine that produces 310 horsepower with 400 foot-pounds of torque. We have telescopic steering as well, air conditioning in the chassis, power windows, power locks. We have a couple of safety features, including traffic sign assist which is very important to have if you don't know the area adaptive cruise control absolutely fantastic we also have remote keyless start we have wind stabilization assist which is nice to have we also have emergency braking we also have the sos and engine immobilization as well pre-collision and post-collision braking and lane keeping assist and the big one that i actually love is we have electric assisted power steering we also have the fog lights that we order we also have the high intensity discharge headlamps we have the rain sensor windshield wipers we also have high beam assist on all of our chassis and courtesy of leisure travel vans every owner of a brand new leisure travel van gets two years of roadside assistance it's a toll-free 1-800 number they can get you service for if you run out of fuel lock service uh, as a concierge service if you have any problems at all it will help you out and we include that free for the first two years you can also renew that annually if you want to continue with the roadside assistance program. The cab area has got lots of charging ports, 12 volt, USB, USB-C charging ports. You've got a uh, nice storage area up in here. You got map lights in here. Here's your sensor for all your safety features. Make sure you keep your windshield clean. We want you safe on the road. I also like the rear view mirror as well. If you hear a bump in the back, you're not gonna take your eyes off the road. You just can simply look and see if something wasn't closed properly. Let's talk about this. The new 12 inch monitor panel with Sync 4. It's absolutely perfect. It's all voice activated and you can just simply press the button and say navigation. To go somewhere, say drive me to, followed by where you want to go to. You never have to take your eyes off the road. You can simply voice activate things. And so this 12 inch monitor is like a, an iPad. You can control all the different things that you want to do. You can take a look at apps, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. You can also, uh, the features in the chassis, owner's manual availability. All of our Wonder Motorhomes have optional all-wheel drive with intelligent all-wheel drive. If you have the two-wheel drive, you have eco mode, slippery mode, tow haul mode. You can set it whichever way you want. You can also have Sirius Radio. It's a paid-for subscription. Um, you can set your clock. On the vehicle here, you can set auto stop or auto start. You can have that on or off. So what that means is when you come to a stop sign, 
it'll stop the engine start when you uh, release the brake so this is really cool you can actually split the screen so i can have navigation on one side or i can have my radio or my phone information coming off of that so nice to be able to split the screen as well so very simple to use so for all of our leisure customers that buy a leisure travel van we have my ltv it's absolutely fantastic because we have walkthrough videos we have owner's manuals for all the different components that go in the motorhome also on my ltv we have travelers clubs that you can join and you can join a bunch of LTV customers and go caravanning to all these different destinations that they go to and we also have some super contests on my LTV including our photo contest which turns into our yearly calendar so you have some great pictures plus on my LTV we have great blogs from our current leisure travel van owners on great destinations to go to food tips cooking tips you name it parks campgrounds it's got lots of great blogs so make sure you join my LTV Seriously, now that is one amazing interior. Huge bathroom, huge galley, dual sleeping area, make it into a queen bed. I mean, it's got everything. Storage space, absolutely fantastic. The new mocha wood color looks fantastic and the dove leather. Okay, so if you love the interior, let's have a look at the exterior of the brand new 2023 Wonder FTB. Okay, let's start over here on the passenger side or the camp side. So brand new for 2023 on all Wonder motorhomes is the brand new legless Gerard awning. Just simply press the out button and the awning will fully come out. One touch, legless awning. So the awning comes out just over 12 feet in length and seven feet in width, built-in LED lights that you can turn off and on. You can actually use it right off your phone, which is kind of cool. And we also have built-in LED lights up in here as well and built-in LED lights in the handle as well. So lots of nice lighting at night. The awning is absolutely perfect on a hot day. Lots of sun gives you lots of beautiful shade. You're gonna absolutely love this feature on the Gerard awning. And if it's super windy out, don't put your awning out. But in case there's a gust of wind in your kind of RVing and enjoying yourself, look at this. Built-in wind sensor. Couple little things, if you're in a tight little area, you can fold these mirrors in nice and tight. So it's easy to get into your little camp area. Nice little fiberglass step. You can see how we have the molded fiberglass that integrates our body into our chassis. Looks fantastic. Nice and aerodynamic. Let's talk about storage. Storage is always really important. So look at this. Nice big storage area here. Here's our 30 amp shore power connection for our plug-in if you're doing uh, shore power camping and built-in struts that way this door doesn't hit you in the back of the head epdm rubber hinge seal you can see how beautiful that epdm rubber hinge moves the door up and down fiberglass door curved underneath you're gonna love this beautiful handle plus we have our own ltv we call it the switch blade key and we can lock the door in place and now it's nice and sealed you're also gonna love this little storage area right underneath here so easy access for uh, lawn chairs things like that and of course they lock down in place as well strutted as well next compartment next to that is our battery area so standard are agm batteries optional are lithium batteries when you order the optional lithium batteries which give you 200 amp hours we invert the microwave as well so you can run the microwave off of the batteries speaking of uh, inverter right here 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter that's very important all of our new electronics our smartphones all the i things in the world need clean power so in all wonder motorhomes we have standard a 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter so we keep working our way down. Look at the big picture windows. We've got what, one, two, three in this motorhome. So you have lots of natural light inside the motorhome. Awning style windows, of course, sexy frameless glass windows. But the awning style window simply means that if it's pouring rain outside, I can have my windows open, get air ventilation in the motorhome, no water in the motorhome. And look how beautiful this curved wall is. This is a vacuum bonded wall, boxed aluminum frame, vacuum pressed floor, boxed aluminum frame, vacuum pressed roof, two pound density polystyrene, vetrolite exterior skin, full body paint. Each color's painted three times, 
three times, two coats of clear, and we have eight different exterior colors, one that you're gonna absolutely love to make your own on your leisure travel van. So we have silver, which is this color. We have graphite, we have Eurosport, white suede, glacier, shadow, champagne, and everybody's favorite, Atlantic Blue. Okay, let's keep working our way down. I love the LED lights that are built into the awning on the outside. That way you can have your awning in and still have some lighting. Another great option on all Wonder Motorhomes is remote keyless entry. So you can lock the motorhome. You can unlock the motorhome. Okay, as you work your way down, a couple little things here. We have our entry step here, power entry step, and you can turn that off or camping mode. And when it's on camping mode, the step doesn't go in and out every time you open the door. That's a nice way to save the life of the motor. And uh, don't worry if you forget to turn it off. When you turn on the ignition, it automatically goes up, which is very nice. Nice big galley window here. So lots of natural light, awning style as well. As we work our way down, we have our molded fender skirts made out of fiberglass. Once again, full body paint as well. We order all of our transit chassis with 16 inch heavy duty forged aluminum rims. So that comes on all Wonder Motorhomes. Dual wheels, of course, both sides dual wheels. You want to have dual wheels on a motorhome, way more stable when driving. So beautiful Ford aluminum rims. Underneath here, we spray foam all the undercarriage here of the wheel wells. That way stones and stuff won't damage anything. We spray foam all of our tanks underneath as well. That way any rocks or debris won't damage the tanks, gives a little bit insulation makes it quieter when you're going down the road that's very important to have so very nice 178 inch wheelbase also on all of our Ford Transit chassis that we order so a little longer wheelbase a little nicer ride when you're going down the road less overhang which is very important okay standard on all Wonder Motorhomes is the Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater and it's an absolutely fantastic water heater comes out of Germany what makes this hot water heater so unique is it has two different settings Eco and Comfort Plus when it's on Eco it just runs an on-demand system when it's on Comfort Plus, it heats this one liter of hot water. When you turn on any of your faucets in the kitchen, the bathroom, or in the shower, you have instant hot water. As it uses that hot water up, the heat exchangers get hot and it continuously unlimited hot water. Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater, standard on all Wonder Motorhomes. So let's talk about heating a little bit. 16,000 BTU LP furnace to keep you nice and warm. We also have a heat pump built into the air conditioner. So two sources of heat off the air conditioner with the heat pump running the generator or plugged into shore power or the 16,000 BTU furnace running off of propane. Okay. Another great option is what I call our suitcase portable table. If you do a lot of uh, dry camping, not in the campground area, you might need a table. Look at this. Very simple. It's made of aluminum. It's powder coated. It's super strong, locks right in place here into these anchors, adjustable legs, and look at that. You can uh, set up the table, adjust the legs to the height that you want. Pretty simple to do. I think you're gonna absolutely love this little option. Lock it in place. So you have a nice table for outside for dining, sitting back, relaxing. You can put the awning out or you can cook on the table as well. Put your portable barbecue. So here's your quick connect propane. Runs off the main propane tank. Get a little uh, RVQ, hook it in there, put it on your table, start grilling. We also have a 120 electrical plug here if you've got a uh, electric grill so you can cook outside, you can eat outside, you can enjoy the great outdoors. Okay, so next is our four kilowatt gas generator Onan. So it'll run your air conditioner, it'll run everything. If you're a dry camper, you wanna be off the grid. Generator is fantastic because it runs the air conditioner. 15,000 BTU air conditioner, super hot in the summertime in most locations. You wanna make sure that you got your generator running, run that air conditioner, keep you cool. You can run all your electrical, recharge your batteries. This one has the optional lithium batteries so we can dry camp, we're self-contained, we can be off the grid. Okay, now we're at the back of the motorhome. You can see our full fiberglass, rear mass molded fiberglass. Looks fantastic. Contoured into the body of the motorhome and full body paint as well. We've got our built-in backup camera on the new Ford Transit chassis, 12 inch monitor, fantastic. LED lights, LED lights here. And then of course, down here we've got our towing hitch. So the Wonder FTB can tow up to 4,000 pounds. We've got a seven pin connector here. We've got some skid plates on the bottom of the hitch so you don't bottom out, so very nice. We also have our optional ladder as well. And speaking of the optional ladder, nice little option to have. 
but let's go up on the roof and see what we got up there. Our optional ladder is a two-piece ladder, so it locks in place like this, pretty simple. Locks in there, and then up we go. Let's go have a look up on the roof. Okay, we're up on a wonder roof, so you can see how beautiful the wonder roof is. We've got our opening skylight. We have our optional satellite dish, T4, wine guard dish, does dish, direct, or bell. Wine guard booster, which is a Wi-Fi booster and also can be 4G service. Fantastic fans, usually every motorhome has two of those. We have rigid solar panels, either 200 watts or 400 watts. 15,000 BTU air conditioner with a heat pump. Skylights, once again, our other fantastic fan. And the other thing I wanna to point out to is look, how see how every single screw head is completely sealed so no water can penetrate through the head of the screw into the motorhome. So this is a wonder roof. Full fiberglass flex, expands and contracts with heat and cold. We keep it white so that it reflects heat. Absolutely fantastic. Okay, we're over on the driver's side of the Wonder FTB, and this is our outside service center. So this is where we're gonna be dumping tanks, filling up the motorhome with water, having our exterior shower. So let's just talk about these things. This one has our optional macerator pump. Nice little option here is it's already all connected. You can easily drain. If you have to drain uphill, you can. You just simply press the button, open up the black tank, always dump the black first, then the gray. So a macerator pump could even perhaps dump at home if you have a small little sewer center not a three inch line so nice little option to have is the ma optional macerator pump and even if you order the optional macerator pump and the macerator pump fails we always include the three inch dump manual system so you'll never be stranded dumping your tank for dumping the tanks always dump the black first and then the gray this is a sandy flush for cleaning out your black tank. So if you're ever gonna clean out the black tank, you have to hook up your hose and everything, open up the black valve, hook up your hose, and it'll clean the black tank and put it down into the sewer line as well. So always dump black first, then gray, and that cleans it all. Okay, next we have our outside satellite dish connection. If you have a portable satellite dish, you can uh, plug in there. Or if the campground has a cable service, you can plug in there and have cable TV. This is our on-off switch for our macerator pump. And this is our water pump switch. So if you forget to turn on your water pump and you wanted to come outside and use the exterior shower. So it's pretty simple. We're gonna plug this in right here. And then you would turn on your water pump and you've got hot and cold running water for an outside shower. Or if you're a person that does some uh, fishing and you wanna clean the fish outside, you can do that as well. So very simple to do, like the outside shower. Right here, we've got our fill up for our fresh water tank. So we'd run our water hose up through here, plug it in here. And then right here, we have our switch for filling up the fresh water tank or having it on shore power. Outside shower we talked about right there. This is a nice little feature to have. This is a RV antifreeze pickup or a fresh water pickup hose. So what you would do there, if I was gonna winterize my unit, I would hit, hit this valve here over to winterize. I would then put in RV antifreeze into, this, into a jug and then I would turn on my water pump and it would suck up the antifreeze through the water lines. If I was dry camping and I ran out of water and I wanted to put water into my fresh water tank, I could get a jug of water, put it in there and then run that water into my fresh water tank. And then this little tool, this is for draining your fresh water tank underneath the motorhome so you don't have to crawl on all the way underneath there to drain your fresh water tank. So this is our outside service center. I like it because everything is all in one spot. We don't have anything else in another spot that you have to go and do this over there and back over to here. Everything is nicely and conveniently located in one spot. Here's our work our way down. We have our venting for our three-way fridge. So that's, a, once again, a three-way fridge. So it runs on propane. It runs on 120 volt power and 12 volt power. So you have three, three different sources to run the fridge. That's very important. Now that we're on the driver's side, we have our dual rims. Once again, 16 inch aluminum rims that we order from Ford. And then we can see the spray foaming underneath here. We spray foam all the tanks underneath there as well. Okay, one of the big problems with small motorhome, Class B motorhomes is no exterior storage. You're gonna be very, very, very impressed by this. I don't know if I can still do this anymore, but let's have a look at, look how big this storage is. Yes, 
lots of exterior storage. Two sets of clubs, three sets of clubs. I had a customer that was a parasailer, fits his parasail in there, so you've got lots of storage. Nice little LED light for lighting it up, but tons of little storage area here. This is where we keep our optional outside ladder, and we also keep our optional table in here as well, so you've got lots of exterior storage. Okay, and here's where we plug in our 30 amp shore power connection to plug into to run the motorhome. And we've got a built in surge protector on all Wonder motorhomes, so any bad power that might be coming in the motorhome is stopped, prevented from entering the motorhome. That way it doesn't damage any of your electronics. And we have an easy access panel right here to the surge protector. Okay, as we work our way down the motor, look at this beautiful curved wall absolutely fantastic here's where we fill up our propane tank so just over 13 gallons of propane that fills up right there we have a sensor here on the tank and a sensor inside the motorhome so that's very nice close that up and talking about storage right look at this more exterior storage look at this nice little storage area here and this is unbelievable <laughs> look at this even more storage Look at the size of that storage bin. Dual struts built right in, EPDM rubber hinge seal. This is galvanized sheet metal. It'll never crack, it'll never rust. It can handle the cold, it can handle the heat. Carpeted, lined. Once again, I love that this is not gonna hit me in the, in the head. And as I mentioned a little earlier, if you order the macerator pump, we always still include the three inch hose for manually dumping your tanks. Okay, as we move our way forward, you can see our beautiful transition molded fiberglass piece ties in the motorhome into the chassis, aerodynamic curve, got a nice little courtesy light for getting in and out of the motorhome and you're gonna like this for filling up our fuel. We fill it up right there, I can fill it up, no fumes going into the motorhome. And once I got it filled and I closed the door, door locks, now I've got a locking gas cap. That is a very good design. Fiberglass step to get in. We talked about a little earlier, I can fold my mirrors in and out. Here's our front aluminum rims that we order on all of our Wonder chassis. Wow, look how beautiful this motorhome is. Not like a traditional Class C where you're driving in a tunnel all the time. Once again, look at that beautiful molded fiberglass, front mask, panoramic view when you're going down the road. You're not driving in a tunnel because that'll drive you crazy after about five hours. Panoramic view, look how beautiful aerodynamic it looks. And what powers the wonder for 2023, of course, is the Ford Trans transit chassis, HD350 chassis, optional all-wheel drive. It has the 3.5 EcoBoost engine with 310 horsepower, 400 foot-pounds of torque, 10-speed automatic transmission. It has high-intensity discharge headlamps, fog lamps that we order on all of our chassis. It has rain sensor wipers. It has high beam assist. It also has some really great safety features, including front collision impact assist, wind stabilization, lane keeping assist. We also have adaptive cruise control and remote keyless start. How great is that? This is one incredible chassis. So if you're looking for a small, nimble motorhome that's easy to park, big city, small city, out in the wilderness, I think the Wonder FTB is for you. Lots of exterior storage, lots of interior storage, twin beds that can convert into a queen bed. You have a dry bathroom, residential style bathroom with a stand-up shower, a big stand-up shower, huge galley area. You have a nice TV in there, Blu-ray player. I mean, all the conveniences of home. You you can dry camp, you can be off the grid, you want to be on the grid, you want to work from the motorhome, you can do all of those things in the Wonder FTB. Because of our beautiful location in Winkler, Manitoba, we're vertically integrated and we try to build every single part that we can here in our factory. That way we always control the quality of our products. Hey, so make sure you go to our build and price and you can build one of these out with all the options you want. We have three new wood colors, three new leather colors, eight different exterior colors. Absolutely fantastic. It'll show you exactly the way you want to build your motorhome. Make sure you follow us on Instagram and make
make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, hammer that bell, and we'd love to have you. You can see all the latest videos that we have coming. Hey, make sure you go and see your local leisure travel van dealer and see one of these beautiful motorhomes in person, or hopefully we can see you at an RV show somewhere in North America. I sincerely want to thank all of our customers that have supported our company since 1965. All of our customers are fantastic. Hey, Dean from Leisure Travel Vans, thank you for watching the video. Can't wait to do another video for you.